episode 146. I hope you are very well this week and thank you so much for all of your kind messages. I am now completely better from COVID. I've got a few things to tell you about and I'm gonna show you just a little bit where I am. So this is Haggerston. It's a great word, isn't it? And it's kind of gritty, nice uh, inner London. It's a lot of fun. There are a lot of fun places to be hanging out around here. So things coming up that I would really love to tell you about is in the coming weeks, I'm coming to Netherlands and Belgium on tour. So if you're based out there, please come, please check the website anatam.co.uk and find out about that. If you're not there, but you know people, please will you spread the word? I've never even been to the Netherlands before. So in order to get great audiences for the concerts, please just like tell your friends because I would love to be like going out and having, having great concerts there. That would be really kind of you. Other things still happening in the UK. So I've got one more cathedral this year, that's Hullminster. And then there's also still some folk clubs and things like that. So lots, lots happening. Talking of folk concerts, I'm gonna take you over to the Green Note Camden, where I played on Sunday. And I've got a clip of a song that I've written myself. So it's the first time I've written the lyrics and the music all for a song together. It's called Hanged Woman. <laughs> and I'm going to explain about that in the gig, but it's, it's based on uh, Norse mythology and a little bit on tarot cards as well. So yeah, okay, here we go over to the green note where I will be playing cello and singing. And I've got Karen Wimhurst, who's kindly helped out by playing a bit of frame drum as well for me. I've never written a song before, by the way. So um, this is a new thing for me as in like with the words and all of that um and i've kind of based it on the story of odin um <laughs> hanging from a tree for nine days and nine nights in a search for wisdom um because i wanted to write something about suffering for wisdom and um so i thought i'd just vaguely explain like a little bit of the story so he hung himself from a tree for nine days in order that he could look into this pool in order to receive wisdom and um then like to just make it a bit more intense he also stabbed himself um <laughs> and then tore out one of his eyes and threw it in um that's a nice song Anna. i'm really looking forward to it yeah so um yeah so that's that's what i thought and then the eye then looked up from the pool at the tree and it brought back runes so that is basically the story of how the like writing came to humanity in norse mythology and probably old english mythology as well um so that's uh yeah that's that's what i wanted to kind of bring <coughs> that experience to you which you can do comfortably without you know we just have writing because we learned it at school but for some people it was harder so yeah after that okay all right i'm not okay <laughs> Oh, she 